Welcome to Watch Guide's Daily Security Byte. I'm Corey Nogreiner. Today's story is thousands of hacked websites. A researcher at Malwarebytes released a great blog post talking about how thousands of websites being run by content management systems have been hijacked to serve banking malware and Trojans. The content systems that seem to be targeted include WordPress, Joomla, and Squarespace. Basically, if you're running an older version of the content management system, it seems like the attackers can inject code into your website. But what's interesting about this campaign is how advanced it is and how much it uses to obfuscate its attack. Basically, once they inject some malicious JavaScript into your website, one thing they do first is any victim that comes to your website, they'll check to see whether it runs one of the vulnerable browsers they're targeting, things like Firefox, Chrome, and then it will go to Dropbox to download an additional obfuscated piece of JavaScript. And basically, to the user visiting a site, usually they'll get a pop-up saying something like, it's time to update your Firefox or Chrome browser, or it's time to update Flash. And the user has to interact in order to get this malicious JavaScript download. Uh, they do a lot of interesting things, like they will only serve a visiting IP one time to avoid uh, analysis machines that might connect many times. They also do things like check for sandboxes or virtual machines to try to avoid research machines. And finally, uh, when the malicious obfuscated JavaScript does download an executable payload, that payload actually has a valid digital signature uh, for the malware it's running. And again, it seems to install a banking trojan and or some other kind of Trojan. So it's a pretty interesting new malware campaign. The particular researcher in question did some basic analysis and he found at least 900 sites on one day, just Squarespace sites that were infected with this particular attack. And he actually estimates well over a thousand have been infected. In any case, I'll post a link to the blog uh, showing you this blog post if you want more details about it. That's it for today's news. Thanks for watching.